Hey guys, what is up? My name is Panamaster and welcome to another update video. Don't mind the hair. It's not my greatest hair day. What can I say? Um, but I wanted to make this video now because it's March 1st and I kind of disappeared in February. My bad. Um, yeah, I didn't upload anything here. That's on me. Totes, uh, totes my fault. I essentially have spent the last month. I mean, it's the shortest month out of the year. I think I think that's cool. I, if any month I was going to go AWOL, it was good to be that one. But I was just celebrating Black History Month, you know? But uh, I, I needed some time because this is essentially the part of the year where I need to reevaluate and look at what my year is going to be in terms of living situation, in terms of work situation. This is the time that I need to kind of get that figured out. And so that's what I've been doing. And I'm still not all the way there yet. Let's be real. Um, but I've made some decent progress and I've, you know, made some decisions and I didn't stream near as much, barely streamed at all. Uh, it was just kind of reconfiguring. Because uh, most of the progress that I've made both here and over on Twitch just kind of flatlined um, the last few months. And I just struggled to figure out what to do. Um, to figure out what I was supposed to be doing. What was the right path. And so a lot of February was spent figuring out what should I do now? What change do I need to make? To make better content and also not feel that burnout, specifically um, when it comes to YouTube content that has just kind of hampered my progress in such a dramatic way. Um, so, yeah, I've got things much more solidified over on the Twitch side. It's bothering me that this is so high up, so my bad. Um, but... I've got things much more figured out on what I want to do on the Twitch side. YouTube, I'm going to get to in a second. That's a little bit more up in the air. But as far as Twitch goes, I was looking back on the couple of years now that I've been semi-consistently streaming and was looking at just what what are the aspects I liked about it the most? What do I gravitate to as well as what do people respond well to? And I, th I just, I landed on consistency. Consistency, I think, is the key. And I've said it before, but I didn't quite understand the meaning of it and what that all could entail. And so, because of that, starting Sunday, everything's going to change. Cue dramatic 2010 background music. Um... <laughs> I'm not editing this video, so that's not happening. But so every Sunday, every Monday, and every Wednesday, I'm gonna be streaming. All right. Um, Sunday's a little different, so we'll come back to that one. But Mondays and Wednesdays, every single Monday and Wednesday, every single one of them, I'm gonna be streaming at 6:30 p.m. Eastern. That's 6:30 p.m. Eastern. That means it's 3:30 Pacific. Uh, I'm gonna be streaming. A little Overwatch to start. Love me some Overwatch. My regulars know this. Um, just a little bit. Just for the first hour. As people tend to populate in, um, a lot of times uh, my viewers won't come until like an hour, um, sometimes even two hours in. And so I wanted to give some time to populate, but also have some fun. The early people who show up, if you play Overwatch, you can play with me. I love playing with viewers. That can be a thing, but I'm going to be playing Overwatch every Monday and Wednesday on Twitch. For the first hour. I'm going to be streaming for about three hours. What I'm going to be doing for the rest of that time. Is playing The Sims. Because I am no Sims mega fan. I really enjoy The Sims. The Sims 3 is one of my most played games. But. Um, EA refuses to make The Sims 5. But I also have the worst possible luck imaginable. So my strategy here. Is I'm going to put a lot of time and resources and some money when it comes to buying DCs late DLCs later on. Um, I'm going to start investing resources into The Sims 4 
and EA will announce The Sims 5 this summer. You're welcome, Sims fans. Um, I can guarantee that'll happen uh, because the Lord Jesus Christ loves to waste my time. <laughs> but so, yeah, I I tried doing this a year ago, about a year ago. Um, some of my regulars will remember this. Uh, and I had some moderate success, but again, I just lacked the consistency. I lacked the willpower and the energy to just keep it going. So I'm starting fresh and I'm also, I decided I wanted to do this. So when I start, I'm going to put all my Twitch subs into the house uh, with their permission. You know, uh, if anybody doesn't want to, for some reason, that's fine. Um, but with everybody's permission, I'm going to put my Twitch subs in the Sims little my, my little panda hype house right so if you guys would like to be part of my little sims playthrough uh just go subscribe over to my twitch it's not that bad it's pretty nice and uh you know you'd be helping me out what can i say i'm a poor schmuck um you know a little schmedlin or something i don't know some sort of some sort of word that would work in that situation i don't know um uh, a schmeagle if you will <laughs> but yeah, I want to play The Sims, and I, I, I think it would be really fun to try and keep that going, and there's also a little connection to the YouTube side of things that, again, I'll get to in a minute, but yeah, every Monday and Wednesday, I'm going to start off with a little Overwatch, get warmed up, let some people congregate, and then we're going to launch into some Sims, and we're going to have fun. I want to have the chat guided as much as possible, so if there's something you guys want to see certain people do or what we want to kind of work on for the stream, you know, I want chat to be an active part, and it can be sort of our playthrough of the Sims. And like I said, as time goes, I want to keep adding on deals. I only have the main line, like the base game, so... I want to like add on DLCs at like kind of a, a good rate to where uh, I can hopefully catch up right and have everything. But so it can build more naturalistically, not that I just buy everything because one, that's super expensive. And two, I just think it wouldn't function well. Like, let's build a story here, guys. Let's get a lifetime movie adaptation. You know what I mean? <laughs> but I think it'd be really cool. And that's starting on Monday. It's going to be every Monday, Wednesday. 6 30 p.m eastern don't forget it that's why i've said it a bajillion times now i said sundays are a little bit different and that'll be the first one coming up because i'm not doing this week's wednesday stream as i'm going to be house sitting for someone so i'm not going to be around but um so this sunday will be the first stream that i'm back and it's going to be a little different for one it's starting at noon eastern 12 p.m uh, it's going to be an afternoon stream. This is because I wanted to have three streams a week, but my work schedule makes it a little chaotic to do like to have myself freed up three evenings out of the week um, because I work evenings. Uh, it's just uh, it's not very consistent. So this is to kind of help that and also try to reach a different potential demographic because some people can't really, uh, you know, spare time at their evenings because maybe they work evening shifts or whatever. So this gives an opportunity for other people to be able to join in the fun and community and help uh, help grow my audience potentially, you know, knock on wood. So Sunday afternoons, 12 to 3, I'm going to be playing some Avengers to start. I know, interesting choice has nothing to do with channel growth. It is 100% a personal choice. I've platinumed the game, but I haven't completed it because I still haven't touched Spider-Man or Jane or Winter Soldier. And so I'm going to do that. That's essentially, this is my time to, uh, to do that, to essentially grind away at the game without wanting to split my head open due to how grindy the game is. Um, I'll just play it for like an hour a week, you know, maybe some off stream, but like that's going to be the warm up game uh, because I have it on PS5 and the game I'm going to be playing afterwards is on PS5. So that's why it's not Overwatch because it's a different platform and I'll be damned if I'm playing Overwatch with a controller <laughs> in the year of our Lord 2023. Absolutely not. But gonna play some Avengers to warm up again strictly just for me but if I can get some Avengers fans in the chat cool awesome good for you guys I guess the like 150 of us left in the world <laughs> but yeah I figured I, I gotta complete this game before it dies you know I gotta do it I gotta do it so that'll be the start and then I'm gonna play Tomb Raider I've been wanting to play Tomb Raider 
so when I first started streaming consistently back in like August of 2020, I played South Park, the stick of truth, and then subsequently the fractured, but whole, um, and I miss playing through a game to completion. You know, I do that so rarely on my Twitch nowadays. I'll do it for like the big stuff like Ragnarok, Resident Evil 8. I'm going to do that again for Resident Evil 4. I just don't have specifics yet. So that'll be the the one deviation right now um, to the stream schedule. I'll still do my three streams, but then I'll have some more when Resident Evil 4 comes out, hopefully on launch day. I just don't know my work situation quite yet. It's kind of pissing me off, but uh, I've been trying to get that off. We'll see how it goes. But uh, I am going to be streaming Resident Evil 4 in its entirety because y'all know me i'm a resident evil gamer yeah you know i'm saying I, I, I like me some spooky scary zombies and stuff even though this isn't zombies anymore shut up xbox anyway i didn't mute my tv because i thought it wasn't going to do anything i was wrong uh warzone just finished installing because i thought about streaming that but i decided against it but it was already enough and i didn't want to waste the gigabytes so there you go um <laughs> yeah uh so yeah i want to play tomb raider I, it's been forever since i've played the game i've been wanting to replay it for years and also i never beat rise don't crucify me i didn't i beat shadow because i got it with my one x when i upgraded from the one s to the one x in college it was a it was back when i had expendable money and life was better but i just didn't realize that at the time so I played all the way through Shadow. I think it's a great game. Probably the worst one. I can't specifically say because I haven't finished Rise, but it probably is like the worst one. But I still thought it was a solid 8 out of 10. But the 2013 Tomb Raider is one of my favorite games of all time. I'm obsessed with it. I've played it multiple times. But yeah, it's been a while since I've replayed it, and I want to do that. And I think it would be a fun game to play on stream. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be playing it on PS5. I'm playing the Definitive Edition for the first time because I've only ever played it on PC, the original version, you know. So I'm used to the new character model because of Shadow and Rise, but it'll be interesting to see if I feel any different playing the Definitive Edition. I don't think so, but maybe. We'll see. So that's starting on Sunday, this Sunday. <laughs> Sorry, I think I'm coming down with a cold, and I'm, I'm, I'm kind of upset about that. But uh, yeah, Sunday, Monday, Wednesdays. Sunday afternoons at noon, come on down for some Avengers and Tomb Raider. And then on Mondays and Wednesdays, 6.30 p.m. Eastern, going to play some Overwatch and then The Sims. And it's going to be really fun. And I think it's going to bring some much-needed consistency. I want to be able to have people come to my Twitch and know exactly what they're in for. To an extent, you know, we'll have some fun surprises here and there because you got to keep it interesting. But I want people to... Feel like I can be re a reliable content creator to them um, and try and build something. You know, I want to try to build a community, you know, have some more people join the discord. And again, this is for the foreseeable future. I'd like this to be something that sticks, but ultimately I'm going to do what's best for the community and the channel. And so if I decide to kind of, you know, j pursue other things, obviously I'm going to stick this. I want to make sure this is something that goes but if something's not doing well or people aren't really liking something, I can obviously change things as needed. But I want to make something with you guys. That's why I think The Sims is going to be really fun. That's why I think it'll be fun to play through the Tomb Raider games because I, I do want to go on to Rise and Shadow and have fun with that. But I, I think this could be really fun. And I'm excited for this new direction and hopefully you guys are too. Again, if you want to join the Panda Hype House, go sub over to my Twitch. It's super cool, super cheap. You can even use your Prime sub if you have one. It's super awesome. And it helps me out a ton. Uh, helps me buy my coffee that I don't drink. Um, yeah, really fun stuff. And so that's kind of how Twitch is going. YouTube is a different ballgame. I spent a lot of time thinking about Twitch. Not a lot of time thinking about YouTube. Because the hardest part about YouTube is it takes so much more effort than Twitch. You know, it's not to say that Twitch is an effort. You know, there's a lot of effort that goes into your production value and the analytics of what you should versus shouldn't stream. You know, um, there's definitely a lot of hard work that goes into Twitch, but the production value of YouTube is a lot more time consuming. And so I get burned out super easily on YouTube because this is all a side gig for me, a side gig that pays virtually nothing. So 
it's difficult for me. I can only allocate so many resources to this, right? So I was trying to think of something a little more sustainable, but yet I also forgot to mute my phone, but that's fine. I, I wanted something that could be consistent and reliable, but wasn't so time consuming. And I'm still going to experiment with that. I think YouTube shorts are the way to go. I want to make some more highlight videos. I do want to do some more recommendations when things come along like I did in January. I think that's a really fun idea. I also want to have parody with TikTok. You know, I've experimented a little bit with uploading stuff on my TikTok, but I don't really want to make like a brand TikTok or anything like that. Uh, TikTok's where I shit post. You know, my, my main social medias are Twitter and TikTok. That's what I use the most. I mostly just dabble over in Facebook and Instagram. I just look at other people's stuff, you know. I text people on Snapchat. You know, my Twitter and TikTok are my things. And so I, I, I don't necessarily want to go full like, oh, how do I grow my TikTok audience? I don't really care about that. But I do know I can help grow this community through TikTok. And I want to try and do that more. And so I want to have that parity between the two. Um, because I've had some mild success on TikTok through uploading some like stream highlights and stuff like that. So I want to kind of try to lean into that a little bit more. Um, so go follow my TikTok. It's PanamasterCC, same as my Twitter username. Go follow both for, you know, updated info and lots of cool stuff. And like I said, I like to shit post on TikTok too. So you might find some funny things of me trying stupid trends or just making a fool out of myself as I usually do. Um, but yeah, Panamaster CC stands for content creator because Panamaster was taken. So, yeah, but I want to do some more of that stuff. Um, I'm also thinking because Tomb Raider, I don't really have any reason to preserve that. It's the same thing. But the Sims, you know, those VODs only last for a couple months. So I would like to kind of edit the two streams a week into one video um, and just have a, a weekly upload on YouTube is kind of like the highlights of the Sims. Kind of like I, what I was thinking is, you know how like Dan and Phil used to play the Sims and Dan and Phil games. It wouldn't be as heavily edited as that because that sounds like a nightmare, but I would kind of like to edit together the Sims streams uh, just for preservation. Uh, and then if people, you know, couldn't make it to the streams, they can catch up through there and just, you know, again, it would help make things a little better and have a lot more fun. And so we'll see. We'll see. I just I don't know if I'm going to have the time. That seems pretty time consuming. But I thought, you know, every Friday upload because you got this Monday stream, you got the Wednesday stream. I can start editing the Monday's content on Tuesday, finish things up on Thursday. Maybe, maybe, maybe we'll see. Um, it's, it's, it's just a couple hours. Like that's like four hours of content. Essentially I'll have to kind of sift through, um, which doesn't seem too bad, but who knows? I don't know. Uh, we'll, we'll see. That's kind of up in the air, but I'd like to do it if I can. Um, so maybe get some Sims videos up here and I'd like to keep making the list for you guys. They are very time consuming. Um, We'll see. We'll see. Like, I think my main focus right now is the shorts and potentially those Sims videos. That's kind of what I'm looking at for YouTube here. We'll see how that goes and what I can kind of build on. And then, you know, but like I said, I'm still pretty experimental with how I want to run YouTube over here. Um, but Twitch, I, I like this. I think I found something solid and I want to keep doing some cool stuff. So, yeah, um, this is the longest update video I've perhaps ever done. Uh, but I, there's just a lot of stuff I wanted to cover and go over, and I think this change will be good. Hopefully, it doesn't blow up in my face, because like I said, this next few months, I'm going to have some life changes, which means schedule changes. So hopefully, I can adhere to this, like it won't change anything. But if it does, I I'll still do the three. I'll let y'all know, but I think I'll be okay. I think this schedule will work regardless of what happens in my life in the next few months, and I can just keep this going. Because I love you guys and I want to build something and I want to have a community. And I feel like I've said that a billion times, but that's that was how I feel. So thank you guys for watching. Like, if you like this video, subscribe if you want to see more. Like I said, Sunday. Sunday is the next time y'all are going to see me. Sunday afternoon, play some Avengers, play some Tomb Raider, get that started. Then going into the weekend Monday, playing The Sims, some Overwatch. 
having fun there potentially some new youtube you might even see me before sunday you know if something really awesome drops i guess like a cool show or movie or something i might make a short about it i don't know um but yeah sunday probably the next time you'll see me uh have a great day have a great weekend um like i said i'm gonna be house sitting and dog sitting for the most beautiful dog in the world i'm very excited about that gonna play a bunch of overwatch because i don't want to bring my consoles with me um but yeah uh, have fun, guys, and I'll catch y'all on the flippity flop. Peace. God damn it. A notification popped up right as I uh, clicked stop on the record. So we're going to try that again. Um, peace. <laughs>